Timothy Hardcastle is a judge on Pooch Perfect and a Master Groomer. Yes, that's an official title. Her love for dogs started when she was little, watching Meg on Blue Peter each week. I think you're going to like this. Now she has three poodles and more dog grooming trophies than you can count. So she definitely knows what she's talking about when it comes to doggy makeovers. Put your paws together for Verity and her dog, Lily. <laughs> Verity and Lily, welcome to Blue Peter. How are you? <laughs> Can we just talk about Lily for a second? She is so cute. She's been making friends with the crew all yeah. day. She's really fitting in here. Can you tell us more about her? <laughs> so, she's so adorable. She is. She's nearly 12. She's <gasps> a miniature poodle. And she lives at home with my other two miniature poodles, Alice and Olive. Oh. I love this breed. They are so fun, so energetic, and honestly, she makes me laugh every day. <laughs> she looks great for 12, doesn't she? Oh, oh yeah. Okay. <laughs> Do you know what? I have to be honest though, Barry and obviously Lindsay knew this already. Mm -hmm. um, I'm a bit scared of dogs, but Lily, I think we could. I think we could get on. As long as you've got little chicken bits in your pocket, <laughs> she's happy. <laughs> we've worked out the secret. <laughs> and you know what? So many BP fans have written in say they love Pooch Perfect. I've got a comment here, uh, Crazy Cat Meow. They've said, I would definitely recommend Pooch Perfect. It's amazingly stunning. And Holly agrees, <laughs> and she's also said, I think Pooch Perfect is the best. So for anyone who's yet to catch up on Pooch Perfect on iPlayer, what is it all about? So it is a dog grooming competition right. where we take 16 professional groomers and they throw them loads of different challenges and we're basically trying to find the nation's top dog groomer. Wow. I'm barely even listening. I was just looking at all the squishy <laughs> dogs in slow-mo. Um, <laughs> tonight is the quarter-final, so what can we expect? So we're going to see the Bichon and we're going to see them transformed into these beautiful <gasps> so fluffy, fluffy clouds. Oh. Then we have the Dogology <laughs> Challenge where you can guess the crossbreed at home and then we have the Dog Walk. So it's a round the world challenge where they may depict a monument or a memorable holiday oh, cool. on the dog. Oh, if the Blue Peter cool. bosses are wearing, please, please, can we get one? <laughs> Two, can we get three? You're so funny. Okay, what I'm trying to understand though is why is dog grooming so important? It's so important for their health and well-being. Right. These dogs, their hair grows all the time. Mm. So if it gets knotty, overgrown, tangled, that can really create some skin issues. It's uncomfortable for the dog. So it's really important. Oh, cool. Well, you know what? We love a challenge on BP, and so does Betty from Staffordshire. And she wrote this on her purple badge form, so check this out. I challenge the presenters to go head to head in a dog grooming competition, winner takes it all. Okay, Ooh. Betty. Do you think we could make her dreams come true, Verity? Betty, yes, we can. Cool. Yeah. Yeah. So we're going to recreate our own Pooch Perfect Challenge with these model dogs. Obviously, we don't trust yeah. real dogs. They're oh. not real. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> so we want you to create a poodle trim on these dogs, a bit like maybe Lily's trim here. OK, this is the bit in the show where we say, please don't do this on your dog at home. It's, it's not fair on your dog. We've had proper training from an expert. You can see it earlier, actually. This was us uh, during rehearsals. Look, but I think we were Ooh. actually doing OK, weren't Let's we? Let's go. I love this. So how, do you, how much time do you normally get in a competition? For a dog grooming competition, yeah. to do this size dog, you'd normally mm -hmm. get two hours. Right, and, and we've got about 20 minutes, so this is going to go really well today. Oh, God. Yeah, and of course, these aren't real dogs. These are just um, mm -hmm. models, aren't they, which professional dog groomers practice on, so yeah. I think we should be OK. OK, so when do we start? Well, it is a pooch perfect challenge, so obviously, right. we begin on the bark. Oh. oh. Have you got him? <laughs> Yay! <laughs> so have we started? OK, yeah, this is it. Go, go. I don't know where I'm going to... My dog just fell. <laughs> That's OK. I'm scared. Oh. Okay, okay, let's just go. Comb, comb, comb. Oh, yeah, comb. Whoops. And off they go. Well, keep... uh, not, gr uh, not great. My tail's come <laughs> off and it fell on the floor. This little pom-pom. So I'm going to try and stick that. I'm not sure this is how you're meant to do it on real dogs. Just take the tail oh. off. Yeah, I know what you mean, honey. Also, my dog keeps barking. So oh, stop it. You know what I mean? Uh, Verity, have you got any tips for us? Because we need some help. <laughs> so, obviously, we're wanting to see a poodle trim here. So, maybe we're going to do a top knot, because most people okay. poodles have this on the top of the head, some fluffy ears. Okay. And you might want to do these pom-poms on the bottom of the legs. Hmm. 
Ah, yeah, might want to, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so far, maybe put the tail back on. I think that you've got some really nice shape going on. You're mm. both working so fast, which you need with the 20 minutes you've got. Right. Uh, really good shape here as well. You've done loads. OK, how Thank much you. time have we got left? Ah, uh, Lindsay, I think you have about 12 minutes left, so you oh. need to get a move on. No. Yes, come on, get a move on. Hey, Gares, how are you getting on with your dog grooming? Um, well, because they're not real, my tactic is to do a bit of cutting and then kind of go... <laughs> <laughs> wow, wow. Uh, Moaxi, what about you? How are you getting on? I think I'm actually almost done. I think perfection ah! is this way. Oh, OK. Right, uh -oh. we have about three <laughs> minutes left. No! There's three minutes left. <gasps> oh, that's oh, time. No. Time is up, Gares. Oh. Step away oh, no. from your poodles. <laughs> OK. Now, uh, <laughs> Verity, before you judge a winner, just remind us again what you asked Lindsay and Moaxi to do. So we wanted to see that quintessential poodle groom. So maybe a top knot on the top of the head, some bracelets down at the bottom, and maybe some fluffy ears. <laughs> so that here is what it's supposed to look like. And then this is what Lindsay looks like. <laughs> Sorry, I think that's right. brilliant. It looks all right. You haven't had long. What's your, what's your thoughts, Verity? And I, I had to stop to watch the Hovercraft film because it was so good as well. So <laughs> I've had even less time. Well, hey. <laughs> So you've put a bow in the top knot, which mm -hmm. is which is cute. Mm -hmm. Not so sure about the bow around the tails. <laughs> that might annoy the dog a little bit. <laughs> you've done some really. <laughs> Whoa! Oh, we were not supposed perfect. to see that. <laughs> <laughs> some really nice shape mm -hmm. on the dog. I think you've done really well considering you're not a dog groomer. Mm -hmm. Okay, Moaxie's poodle. What, what's your thoughts on that, Verity? Well, Moaxie, I feel like you have pulled it out of oh. the bag from the rehearsal we did earlier. Thank you have a really you. super top knot. Some really nice rear leg angulation, as we call it. That's that like shape to the dog. Yes, I was going and, to uh, And crazy use of accessories. And I, I have only just noticed the mess Lindsay has made on yeah. the floor. <laughs> Look at that. Lindsay! There's so much oh. mess. Sorry. Sorry, <laughs> no, no, Verity, only one can be best in show. So please tell us, <laughs> please reveal the best groomer. So the winner of this amazing <laughs> best in show, Blue Peter Rosa, is Moaxie! <laughs> Well done, Waxy! Waxy, do you know what that means? Do you know what that means? No, what does it mean? Your prize is that you get to bath Henry. <laughs> Hello, Richie here. Subscribe to the Blue Peter YouTube channel right now. Check out our playlists, like this video, and if you want to watch brand new Blue Peter, head to the BBC iPlayer.